What's up guys? Well, uh, today's gonna be quite an interesting day. Me and Neiman have um, added a bunch of new things to our panel. So as you can see in here, the panel is very much updated. So we're gonna be testing out that. Um, also, if you look out there, there's some Lenny's. So there's predicted to be wave. So uh, hopefully we get into that. Anyway, it's gonna be a pretty fun day of flying. Um, really honestly don't know what's gonna happen yet, but hopefully we'll get into the wave and hopefully all this stuff works. Okay, catch you in a bit. Well, would you look at that? We're flying. Not only that, we're actually climbing. We're only climbing at about uh, two knots right now. We're climbing even a little better earlier. Uh, but, I mean, we're at almost 9,000 feet in waves, so uh, it's a good day. All the instruments are working. It's a good day. Gecko 9,300 feet over New Kalinga. I got a glider off my left wing. This Gecko is out probably on the uh, 2006. That five hotel is upwind. Yelp 4 and Yelp 5. Feet, still climbing at about one knot. Um, here, I'll undo the GoPro and I'll show you around. There's lenticular clouds up the wazoo. I mean, we're flying on this line here. There's some behind me. There's a row in front of me. I mean, there is just lenny's all over the goddamn place. So, uh, it's a real good wave day. I mean, who would have thought out of Avenal, California, where there's like wave probably four times a year, we'd get one on a Sunday where everyone's around. So, uh, yeah, pretty good day. This is pretty awesome. Echoes made it almost to 12,000 feet. Look at that, so pretty out here right now. I'm uh, just below 13,000 feet. I'm uh, heading upwind now, trying to get into the next wave. But honestly, I haven't really hit any areas of sink for the most part. It's just been heading upwind in about, like, let's see, average of 0.3 lift. So, I mean, it seems like a lot of the air is going up right now, which is pretty awesome considering that wave can also oftentimes have really bad sink. So yeah, we keep flying. Join the views. Well, I made it 
did up to 15,500 feet and then I got into right near the clouds and I didn't really go any higher because I didn't want to get sucked in the clouds. So that was cool. Now I'm descending a little because I think I've kind of run off the end of the wave. Uh, but I'm going to see if I can pick something up up ahead here. Uh, yeah, but it's a good day. Pretty cold up here. But a uh, really nice view. If you look out there, the clouds are just incredible. Still up here. It's about 2, 2.30 I think. Let me see. Oh no, it's 3.12. A little later. Um, but yeah, back in the wave again at about 12,100 feet. Uh, it's pretty neat. We got some crazy verga out here to the left. It's like a little swirly verga stuff. Um, not totally sure what it means, but pretty cool to see. Uh, the curve is pretty neat. You can see the wind change with altitude, so that's definitely cool. Uh, but yeah, we're still out here. Probably gonna come into land fairly soon. My feet are getting cold, my hands are getting cold. You know, this uh, cloud cover makes it a little cold, especially when it's only like 55 degrees on the ground. So, you know, up here it's probably negative, I don't know. Maybe not negative degrees, but below freezing. So uh, yeah, we'll probably call it pretty soon. But uh, yeah, it's good flying. kind of hard to hear because we're really screaming along now but uh it's time to go down <laughs> i'm getting cold my hands are cold my feet are cold so i'm just gonna fly at 85 or 90 knots for a bit and do some altitude and then we'll go land uh it's been quite a good day um really my second time flying in wave um i flew in wave two days ago um with kevin shaw and his motor glider one kilo sierra and it was a great time, and then I did it today again in uh, Whiskey Echo. Um, maybe I'll put in a little footage from my flight with Kevin uh, at the end of this. There were some really pretty clouds down low at the, uh, at, the, at, at the end of the flight. Anyway, it's been a great flight, and uh, I'll catch you after the landing probably. It's going to you know, scream around until I've lost enough altitude to land. Uh, I think the highest I topped out at was like 15.5-ish. Um, and then I got pretty close to the clouds and didn't really want to go any higher, which honestly out of Avenal, that's great. Anyway, a great time, great flight, time to go down and warm up the feet. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 